uh, from, <laughs> from eight Robert. By 10. Eight we by signed 10. it from the Kelly Show. And um, so we want to give this away. And what we want to do is. Hi, and welcome to Kelly, where we talk about life, your life and my life. And through Kelly, we hope to inspire. I have Robert Vines on the show today. And Robert Vines played with bands such as Molly Hatchet, uh, Cameo. What's some other bands you were? Well, I worked with Molly Hatchet and you... Cameo. Yeah. Okay, uh, and then band, you drummed for uh, drums I played, Great uh, White. Well, uh, Tony Montana, formerly a Great White, who's actually back in Great White right now. Okay. Okay, and uh, also his own band. And um, then I also progressed on with uh, the Rusty Wright Band, which was a blues band, and they were also charted on Billboard uh, number three on the, on the charts. They're still out and touring. And since I left Rusty Wright Band, I moved into Swamp the Womp for, for a bit. And uh -huh. What actually led to getting out of Swamp the Womp, amongst other things, was that the fact that um, I had played one of my songs for somebody, and they said, well, why, why aren't you doing your own thing? And I never really thought of it. And, you know, and they're like, you know, you, sh you should be what doing do you your mean own you thing. What do you mean you never really thought of it? Well, you know, I, I always was the backseat driver, the foundation of the band, you know, the drummer, uh -huh. this, that, you know. I've toured, managed, you know, um, every, everything in the aspects of that. But as far as bringing myself out front and being a front man, I never thought that I had it, you know, or what it even took to do that, to achieve that, you uh -huh. know. And um, just out of you know, people pushing me, I decided, you know what, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give it a shot. So... Um, you know, while I was on tour with, with Mona, you know, I was their stage manager, guitar tech. I actually ran into a few people in the record business, and um, one of them asked me if they could hear the song. So I went ahead and played it, and uh, she was amazed, and, and that, that actually sold it for me. So, uh -huh. so, so now you're, front, you're fronting your own band. Yes, yes. And your band is? Uh, Robert George Vines. Yep, yep. Named after me, and uh, basically what what happened is you know we've got the album and um, my right hand man who's actually we've been in bands together throughout the years. I mean almost almost thirty years of working together. Uh, big Bill McKenna, he's actually my tour manager and uh, he's also the producer and you know with the album and we're in the studio and he's producing it and all that. So we're finishing up. It's a ten song album that'll be out coming out next year with a world tour. <sighs> And all that's being set up, and so I'm, I'm anxious to do that. Yeah. Very much so. Um, so where do people find, if people want to check you out, where do they find you? Well, anything as far as bio or anything up and coming, you've got, you've got Facebook, you know, my Facebook or, or Instagram. Um, as for in bio or anything like that, they can go to um, www.promark.com, or they can go to deodoria.com or evansdrumhead.com, and uh, under the artist, just press you know, select artist and type in my name, Robert Vines, and all the information will pop up, uh, and you're set, ready okay. to go. So going from, um, to, uh, going into the place that you are now, being head of a, of a band, what, what are the struggles for you? <laughs> Everything. Uh -huh. Every, I mean, from, from pre-production, to writing a song, to coming up with something that's going to be tangible, the music, because I, I write the music as well. I don't have anybody wow. do anything. I, I write all the parts, the guitar parts, bass parts, keyboard parts, if any, drum parts, fault wow. along, everything. I do have session people that, that do that, uh -huh. you know, the parts for me, you know, so it doesn't take much time me having to play every part and take right. the time and go through the steps. So I have a session. You now, know. but when you go on tour, will you have a full band? I or will. You, okay. I will. Okay. I will. And, uh, you know, it's not written in stone yet, so uh, there will be auditions and there will be an open open cattle call, as like we, we like to call it. Nice. You know, so, you know, when what? that when that comes in, it'll be posted through management. Okay. Definitely. Okay. Good. Definitely. That's awesome. So I met you, you. You've also kind of transitioned a little bit into acting. That was a fluke and I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm so humble and, and blessed and you know it's just I'm still pinching myself um, how that came about actually was Kristen your friend Kristen Azure right yes right? Um, we became Facebook friends because she was the walking she was I'm, I'm all about vampires and this and that and zombies and stuff so uh -huh. that, that's what that's what drew, drew me to her but we, we became really good friends and and talking I heard of what was formerly a name I'm not allowed to say but the, the movie that was going to be released, and uh, 
You know, I was like, wow, this would really, really be cool if I could just have a little small piece in this, you know. Uh -huh. So I, I just joking around, I had asked her, you know, do you think there'd be a bit part maybe I can play? And she said, LLL, you know, we'll see what we can do. Uh -huh. and, and time went by, and, and, and I was introduced from her to Sparky Bell, who's now become like, he's, he's, he's my... He's my qualm, if I will say, from the movie. I mean, he's just amazing. And uh, he actually gave me an opportunity. Um, we were talking about the movie and, and the plot of the movie. And when he, he told me what was going on, I was like, you know, I'm in the middle of putting an album out. I have 10 songs, and I have one that will fit perfect uh -huh. for the credit roll. Would you, may I send it to you? And he's like, sure. And, you know, I was like, OK. So I sent it out to him. And, he immediately contacted me back and said, I, I have to have this song. So that's how it started. And, and now you have a part in I, it. I, yeah, I know. You know, it's like, <laughs> wow, you know, who figured? But, but from there, I guess he figured he'd give me a small bit part. Originally, I was just supposed to be this hero in the bank, in a bank scene that tried to be the, you know, guy tried to be a hero, shot dead, done. Right. But um, it, it's expanded. Yeah, and of I'm, course. I'm like blown away. Of course. I mean, you're, you're such a good guy, Robert. Just from the uh, short time God that I've gotten you. to Thank know you. you're welcome. Just from the short time that I've gotten to know you, you're concerned about people, you're fair, you want things, you, you want to recognize everybody, and it's That's just such it. a beautiful quality to have. It's very important. You know, I was actually invited, and this is something that actors are never, ever, ever, cardinal rule, never allowed to do, and somehow I don't know who I impressed, but man, it was an amazing night last night. I mean, I was actually invited out to dinner with the higher ups of the movie, you know, and, and I know you know all of them. I mean, so, you know, <laughs> I, Chicken Green, the, the producer, you know, um, the co writer, you know, Christian, you know, she's involved in it too. My favorite zombie. I mean, wow, you know, <laughs> we, got, we got the man that actually wrote it, Mr. Sparky Bell, you know, was at the dinner. Uh, Brandon, you know, um, he's amazing. You had him on the show before, I believe, uh -huh. earlier. Um, with, you know, he's worked with the Fast and Furious and uh, Black Panther. I Jeff, mean, Jeff, uh, Jeff, 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 Jeff. I yeah. always say his name wrong, Jeff. but it's Costanza, Carranza. Carranza. I and, am really good friends with him. I don't know why I can't right. get his last and name And we right. have Brandon, <laughs> who's doing all the fight scenes and stuff. And it was pretty cool because we kind of like acted out some fight scenes last night and all that. So that was, yeah. that was amazing. We've got my. One of my family members was on your show earlier, you know, Mike from Cool yes. and the Gang. I mean, yes. he's there and all, and just the whole gang. It's just a beautiful thing. And, and my wife couldn't have done it without my wife, Kimberly, you know. I mean, she's been my inspiration through everything. Yeah. I mean, just the music, the aspects, um, being there, being on location, um, being at the studio, making sure I have everything yeah. that I need. And you and guys are such a beautiful amazing. couple. Oh, um, so I know that you wanted to mention your sponsors that you have. Yes, definitely. Um, and and I I'm have giving you this for you too. To um, just to say you're a gift in life. Oh, God you can bless eat you. it or not eat it. I don't really care. It's just to say <laughs> I love you. Thank you for oh, being God on the show. You. Thank you so much. <laughs> and I have something for you in return too. Okay. Um, my um, endorsements, as, as I told you, I'm, I'm endorsed with Diodario, Promark, and Evans. Okay. And um, my um, you know, managers and, and representatives of Steve Lobermeyer and Jennifer Took, and a shout out to everybody at Deodorio, Promark, and Evans. But I would like you to have this poster. And okay, is this a Robert Vines poster? We have. Oh, look at this! Interesting. So, guys, and I'm taking up drumming next week. Also, I'll shatter the box, get the drumsticks out. <laughs> what we got is, is for your crew. Um, got some oh, Evans okay. t-shirts for you guys. Awesome. But you know, I thought, you know, and we talked on the phone, and I thought that uh -huh. we'd come up with something really cool, and, and I, I did do that for you. I brought something for one of your winning fans oh, that you can yes. do. yes. And, and what that is, is it's a set of drumsticks, signature sticks, a shirt, and an autographed picture from the both of us. Okay, so, so we're going to, guys, we're going to do a giveaway from Robert Vines and his uh, sponsors. In the box, we have uh, drumsticks and a shirt, and then you have a, uh, a signed um, little picture. It's not really a poster. It's not poster. You got the poster. Yeah. Uh, from <laughs> from, from Robert. Eight by ten. Eight we by signed ten. it from the Kelly Show. And um, so we want to give this away. And what we want to do is who we want people to comment below. And then whoever leaves the best comment, people can kind of 
push like on the comments below. Like the best question or just the, the best advice or something that gravitates people to your comment. And then um, to do that, though, you also have to share this segment. And um, yes, very important. So and then we will uh, get in touch with you and we will mail you this wonderful gift. So thank you, Robert. Oh, Appreciate you're that. You're welcome. That's so cool. So some advice to give to an up and coming um, musician. Up and coming musician, um, also you know, actor, actress, which I am yeah. new to, and I'm, I'm by no means am I a professional actor at all. So this we'll is see. this is we'll really see. this is amazing. <laughs> uh, best advice, hands down, would be, you know, you're just an extension of somebody's thought and dream. Okay, those are the real stars, the producers, the writers, the people behind the scenes, the people that are actually making it happen. Mm -hmm. You're the person that's presenting it, so you're just an extension of them. Those are the real stars. And be water, my friends. Bruce Lee.